Okay, so remember that they're changing my voice. Keep in mind that this video has evidence in it, and the staff at YouTube and Google and in the government, though they don't respect their law, though the law gives them a pass, God does not. And so obstructing justice here means a mark on you and your families, souls in a way that there's no turning back from and your offsprings. So as we look at, you know, in the past where they where they did something like that and it cost them dearly. And a lot of these people have passed away since uh, that moment was maybe like uh, eight, nine years ago where they edited the video where I had the um, I recorded that they had some gargoyle like creature punching some skinny black guy as a hate crime on the wall and the sheriff's Santa Clara County Sheriff Department had played stupid. So on the um, floors, on the tiles, there's some gay harassment imagery. Okay, that's what that picture is on the screen that you see. There's some other stuff that looks like weird occult kind of, you might say Jewish shaped occult images. Uh, a Jewish witch looking female. A Jewish um, kind, of, kind of skinny guy uh, sitting on some kind of occult throne or something. And other other images as well that they've put there. Also, there's the one with the witch that they um, they uh, put on the wooden floor. And I put up this Im uh, this evidence before, but I think that you know you need to see it again. Um, I actually have you know I have other evidence here that I don't expect it to be around much longer because they've tampered with evidence. They've even changed pictures uh, in my house of the way I look. They've changed my shape. They've fumed and poisoned me. Um, they've altered things with technology, okay? At first, I thought they just replaced the pictures with other pictures that they made in the lab. Maybe they did, but I think the evidence shows us that they have a way to alter the, the particles of the material in the pictures and the floor and the wood and various materials to create images and and it's in my bathroom too there, you know, there, there's a lot of evidence to that effect here and my old car is still there it still has a lot of fumes in it you know um, even though the battery's dead so they fume it without using the, you know the car system they use some kind of remote technology uh, to move particles around Look up the Havana syndrome. None of this stuff's far-fetched. And of course, it's a bitch move to try to pretend that the most righteous and sane person that ever lived is magically crazy or something. That's fucking retarded. tinted out vehicle and here's some more dark colored vehicles here they quite often have tints okay and that's commonly associated with psyops fbi national security what have you now what the hell are they running a psyop on me for which is human when human experimentation is illegal okay is it fume me and poison me that's part of why there's there's a film on the on the uh, window okay some of it's from the few, uh, dirt on the outside some from the fumes on the inside there's another black tin So I just drove into the shopping center next to this, and you see, yeah, there's some kind of demon like face on the side bumper sticker. Pets. This guy wearing all dark. It's clear in that car that drove by. I'll take out just for a side hop to a T. You know, maybe a small, there you go, right on cue, right? A small 
percentage of it against this but give me a break here now i'm part white let me give you an example of white social norms whitewashed minority social norms so if i would have pointed this out to someone they'd say something stupid like oh you know i can't really see because there's dirt on the window okay and they'd use the social norms and like ah oh, and they everyone act like an immature person oh I, me too me too right and when you're a serious mature minority okay you're not going to make that mistake you're going to say i see what he's saying you're not going to go out like some kind of smurf some kind of you know simpson jetson fucking worm now keep in mind i'm part white i'm not racist but that is it's cultural what they're doing here a huge huge like the core of gang stalking is white social norms that's what they build on they say you're crazy why because white people and whitewashed people typically you know have this weird you know conformist hyper conformist scale in regards to things they refuse to look at things universally and they look at things in terms of white culture it's just like they say about Americans and their sense of entitlement when they go abroad they expect everyone to cater to them. They refuse to be a man if they're a male. And they refuse to be a woman if they're a male. And it's gotten so bad that they even argue with people about pronouns here in California. 